Natural gas is a carbon-based fuel that will be used transitionally as you move toward green energy. It is available by means of mining, drilling, and fracking. The best source for natural gas is to harvest it from the ocean floor. What makes natural gas so special is the fact that it is renewing much faster than oil or coal. However, there is a problem to be overcome with harvesting natural gas for the use as an energy source. The main problem is the fact that the natural gas in its most abundant form lays on the bottom of the ocean floor from whence it can be withdrawn but the weight of the ocean compresses the gas continually in upon itself, which means that as the gas is brought upward, it expands at a rapid rate and thus is hazardous, and this must be overcome to harvest such. With today's technologies, this is a fairly simple thing to do. And the natural gas, even though it is carbon-based, is cleaner than oil or coal when properly used. And while it will continue to add carbon to the atmosphere that must be cancelled out later. It will not do so in the same abundance. So it may be used as a very beneficial substitute until humanity is able to transition completely to a non-carbon based and renewable source of energy, or should we say sources of energy, for surely those will be hydro, turbine, electromagnetic, static electromagnetic, and other. But that aside, you must be able to transition and you must be able to do so in a way that will allow your current human activities to continue, your travel, your heating, your communications technologies, for ships to be able to move upon the ocean, for planes to fly in the air. All of this must be continued. Cars and trucks must be able to continue to run upon the highways while you transition. And natural gas is a way that will allow this while actually continuing to provide jobs. And while that employment is good employment and would be union employment as you transfer over to your green technologies. And this would allow the large energy companies to hold their investments so they can continue to profit and pour those profits back into humanity. Some of you will say, but companies do not pour profits back into humanity. And it is true that there is a large portion of money taken to the top, and there is a large portion of money that comes to certain individuals 
and corporations, but they are for the moment. The engines that keep your economies running. So natural gas is the next immediate solution as well as fracking of which we have already spoken. So this is just but a beginning, but this is the direction that you must push as you are then transitioning to the many other beneficial forms that we shall describe to you. Just understand that if you take the steps as we give them to you, they will not be painful, they will not be disruptive, and they will save your environment and thus your existence upon this little blue marble. We leave you with blessings and with peace. Peace be with each of you.